Hello, everybody. Meteorologist Hutch Johnson joining you. We have winter storm warning across portions of Wisconsin and Minnesota, and we do have winter weather advisories elsewhere. The storm is getting started. What's the latest? I'll have details in this fast update on snowfall right now. Now, a Hutch's weather update with Chief Meteorologist Hutch Johnson, brought to you by Robert Gibb and Sons. Thanks for watching. Thanks to my fine sponsors. Here's what you need to know beginning now and into the overnight hours. We'll have snow out to the west. That's where things get started. And because the storm is really just getting cranked up, the snowfall amounts there will be a little bit lower. But you see a pretty healthy band in pink here working its way through uh, a narrow band of areas picking up in this uh, three to six inch category. So a pretty good bet of three inches in northeast Montana working its way right through as we go into the afternoon hours. Then it moves into the Red River Valley. So late morning it gets started and it could be heavy at times as we go through that drive time home Jamestown all the way out to Lakes Country here. A healthy band of three inches is going to be likely where you see the pink. I'm going to repeat that. These lower digits you see there in the pink band a good chance at three inches. Some will see six plus. I've got an isolated area or two picking up eight inches or so of snow. Now it quickly ramps down. Most areas in the blue colors here will see one inch of snow. Isolated places up to four inches because that's how snow works. Now as we go into parts of Minnesota where the warning is in place, we'll see a good bet at four to five inches of snow and a few places picking up eight to even more inches of snow. The big winners will be on the south shore of Lake Superior with the north winds fetching moisture off of the Great Lake there. And that's the way I see it. I'll have detailed updates on the track and timing of this, but travel tomorrow could be difficult at times. Winds will be gusting upwards of 40, 45 miles per hour, making visibility at times tricky indeed. I'll keep you up to date with the latest. You can always get your forecast on hutchesweather.com comment until next time see you soon your thanksgiving forecast is set but the real storm watch is when somebody yells are these refs blind for the tenth time at that point you can always say to be fair hutch said visibility might be an issue out there from all of us at hutch's weather happy thanksgiving